This video is sponsored by MessyModdingStore.com. If you're looking for in-game services like Reddit Online Cash or Gold Bars or GTA Money, GTA Modded Accounts, like GTA Online with billions of dollars of cash and pretty much everything in the game, go and check their website out. They have services for all major games. You can even sell them your accounts. Hey, how's it going guys? So today I'll be showing you a very OP and consistent gold bars, money and XP glitch. Infinite gold bars, infinite money and infinite XP glitch. I haven't showcased this variation in a long time. So first of all, just like always, you will need a solo lobby. Good news for Xbox and PC, you can use something called Net, net Cut, N-E-T-C-U-T, -E Net Cut. To get yourself into a solo lobby for ps4 and ps5 it's really easy just change your mtu to either 600 or 800 from the network settings and then you can get placed in a solo lobby and just like i said if you can't change your mtu on xbox and pc use net cut that'll get you in a solo lobby so next you want to get over here to this location just above the o in new hanover and then you want to place your camp at the heartlands so ideally you'll want your camp in the heartland overflow area but my camp was glitched out as you can see right here it's like grayed out so i couldn't like uh change it back it might take a couple of tries but uh, don't worry you will get it there all right so the treasure map that i'll be featuring today is called the citadel rock citadel rock treasure map so if you don't have that particular map it's okay i'll be uh, showing you how you can farm uh so i'll be showing you like five markers that i'll be placing on the map so basically you can farm uh treasure maps in any of those five markers till you get citadel rock so mark these five locations so the first one will be right here the second one will be just uh south of that area so the third and fourth will be close to the end in the heartlands and the last one will be here so in any one of these five markers you can get a treasure map so first of all you will want to avoid the markers so after like basically so that's basically the setup so after you're done with the setup you'll want to press start press online and then select camp so that it uh, so that the game makes a save of your camp location all right so after you spawn in at your camp you'll want to go to the treasure chest the in the yellow search area find the treasure chest and collect whatever is inside of it the gold bar uh, cash and whatever good stuff you get from it because you do get some good stuff and you'll be getting anywhere between uh, one to two gold bars and anywhere between 100 to 200 dollars and if you're doing this on ps5 it'll be incredibly fast and you can make hundreds and like two hundreds of dollars per day if you have time that is so this is what i was talking about when i was telling you to avoid the markers because right now we don't want to get a treasure map so so don't go near the markers because that might spawn in a treasure map and then if you ignore the treasure map you might not find it again for another like 24 hours so you don't want that so try to ride like try to go to the like try to go east as east as possible try to go to the treasure chest from like the right side and then you shouldn't have any problems so right here i was too close anyway so because like one of the random encounters like the treasure hunter encounter spawned and i'll show you what i'm talking about so in it so in case you do still find a treasure map even though you're riding from the right side like if a white dot appears on your mini map and it happens to be on the marker take the map as you can see on the mini map there is a white dot on one of the markers so don't ignore the don't ignore this guy guy or girl uh, because you may not find another treasure map if you ignore 
So you can carry on with the Citadel Rock in the next run, but if you do find a treasure map, just take it. If you find this lady right here, just lasso it and the map will automatically come back on your... I mean, the map will automatically pop up on your satchel. And as soon as you see the name of the map, you'll want to disconnect from your internet because... If you don't, you will enter a three-day real-life cooldown, so make sure to disconnect. Alright, so now let's do the actual glitch. So you'll want to find the treasure chest, like I said, the Citadel Rock treasure chest. Open the treasure chest and take whatever is inside of it. So basically, we can keep farming the same map over and over again. As you can see, I got 1.06 gold bars and I got like $96. But the next time I'll get like $175 and even more gold bars. So just from doing this twice, you can get lots and lots of money and lots of gold bars. And the best part of this, you don't require any rolls. So even if you're a beginner, you can start doing this. So even like if you started playing the game like today, you can literally do it today. <laughs> so there's no requirement at all other than getting yourself in a solo lobby all right so now let's go to the markers and let's get the map that we just opened so make sure to search all the five markers at least two times and if you still don't get a map like 99 percent of the time you will get it but for some reason if you don't just load back into your camp and go to the markers and the map will be there so this is on the fifth spot right here on the big tree so Keep an eye out on the right side of your screen. It's not just any map, it's the map we just opened, the Citadel Rock. So we can keep farming it over and over again. And the most important part of the glitch, don't forget to disconnect as soon as you see the name of the map on the right side of your screen. Or else you will enter the dreaded cool down. All right, so after reconnecting, just load back into your camp and then rinse and repeat the process. And if you don't have the Citadel Rock map, just go to the markers directly and keep farming the treasure maps till you get Citadel Rock. As you can see, this time I got even more, uh, this treasure chest was even more valuable. I got uh, 1.26 gold bars and I got $175. Alright, so let me get the Citadel Rock map again for you guys. So if you remember, last time it was nighttime, now it's daytime, I got it on the same spot. So most of the time you'll get it like on a uh, different marker, but I got it on the same marker as you can see. So just like last time, make sure to disconnect as soon as you see the name of the map. As long as you do that, you can keep farming it unlimited amount of times. And you can pretty much fill up your satchel, like if your satchel is empty, if you don't have any treasure maps, you can fill it up with maximum amount of treasure maps. Alright guys, that's it for this video. Till the next time, take care, bye bye.